Hello, I'm Ethan Burks. Monroe County officials have identified four family members killed in an apparent murder-suicide in Bloomington over the weekend. They are 61-year-old Jeffrey Mumper, 54-year-old Anna Marie Greta Mumper, 26-year-old Emma Mumper, and 18-year-old Jacob Mumper. Bloomington police say investigators have not discovered evidence of a motive in the shooting, but an official says officers still believe Jeffrey Mumper shot and killed the three other family members before shooting himself. Monroe County's coroner says autopsies are set for Wednesday in Terre Haute. Republican State Senator Jim Merritt announced Monday he is retiring after 30 years in the legislature. Merritt's tenure makes him the longest serving current Republican State Senator. He's also the longest serving caucus chairman in the history of the Indiana General Assembly. Merritt authored Indiana's Lifeline Law, which allows underage Hoosiers to call 911 to help save a drunk minor without facing charges themselves. And Indiana University and Purdue each got more than $1.5 million in federal grants to study PFAS in rural water. This is a chemical found in firefighting foams that have contaminated water near military bases around the country. You'd have one well with very high levels of these contaminants and there'd be one, you know, next door that had nothing detectable in it. The chemicals are found in so many of our everyday products that they end up in wastewater that spreads through farm fields. These man-made chemicals have been linked to health problems with the immune system, infant birth weights, and in some cases, cancer. And for weather tonight, we're looking at a low of 66 degrees with clear skies. Before tomorrow and the rest of the week, we see the sun come out and temperatures stay in the high 80s. And then we end the week with partly sunny and then some shower chances on Saturday. For more news, you can go to WTIUnews.org. Be sure to tune in Fridays at 6 for Indiana News Desk. Have a good evening, everybody.